everybody, it's Melissa Beatsome and I am going to show you a site today called Clipping Magic. I like this site because it allows you to remove the background and other objects from any graphic. So you can see this is a graphic and they're highlighting this and they're removing the background. So I'm going to show you how to do that in about three different um, types of graphics uh, that I use in my own business. The pricing for this is pretty, pretty cheap. Uh, $3.99 a month gets you 75 credits and those roll over. So I've been using this for a really long time. I have a ton of credits that are banked up and they roll over so you never lose them. It's well worth it, especially if you make a lot of product photos and things like that. So uh, let's go back over here. I'm going to show you how to do three different um, things to just give you an idea. So let's say that you had a graphic from your own company. Now, your own company gives you graphics and, and things to work with. And uh, if they allow you to use their graphics and alter them in any way, uh, then you can do this. Just make sure that you check your company's policies before you start altering um, images. So this, you can see, it highlights green. And I'm going to highlight anything, just drag and, and draw what I want to keep. Okay. Now I'm going to click the red button to get rid of the background things that I don't want. So I don't want any of this. And now you can see there's a shadow and I could keep that shadow, but I could also get rid of it. So let's clean that up. And see how there's some left here? Let's clean that up too. Got it? So that uh, red dot is going to help you get away um, all of the things that you don't want. Now, you can literally um, just scroll up and it enlarges it so you can kind of get really uh, detailed for certain things. And you can also make this pen point a lot smaller. So if you go down here and click on 20 and you can take that down uh, to, to smaller sizes. Now look how small your dot is. So that really helps you to get into crevices if you just wanted to take a little bit off. Uh, you can kind of draw better with that one. Uh, you can also crop things. So when I was done, I could click that crop button and um, crop anything that I wanted. And now I can take this, hit OK, and I can take this and use it in anything that I want. So I can use that in a different type of graphic. So um, then we're going to go uh, whenever you want. You can download that right there. Um, but we're going to start over and I'm going to show you something else. So now let's think about... Um, taking a selfie or doing something fun uh, with something that you have. So I'm just going to pick a random graphic. This is my daughter and her friend. Um, so I'm going to highlight Sam very badly. Um, so we're going to highlight Jenny. Okay. And then we're going to click on the red one and get rid of the background that we don't want. We don't want any of this. And hopefully this kicks in. My internet is giving me fuss today. So we're going to take out background over here. And let's go ahead and crop this graphic while we're at it. See how... Um, the leaves were over her knee, so we're going to crop that out. We're just going to go like that and crop it out. Something happened to her head. Sorry, Jenny. So let's go fix Jenny's head. We're going to click the plus button again because we want her hair in there. And we want the bows on Sam's head. So you can look at this and kind of clean it up and do whatever you need to do. If there's a part you need or don't need, you can clean it up. That looks pretty good for our purposes. Um, let's get rid of this one little piece by her head. And I want to show you what you can do with this. So um, let's go ahead and download, download results. And we're going to save that as number one, just so we can find it quickly. And then we're going to go over to Canva and we're going to make a new post. And we are going to search for a beach. 
this is just to give you an idea of what you can do with that, especially when you have product photos and things like that. So here's a nice picture of a beach. We're going to put it on here and we're going to size it to the Instagram photo. These are fun on Instagram too. And then go to uploads and we're going to upload Samantha and Jenny, the one that we just did. So we're going to upload them again and then we're going to put them on the beach and we can size that and put it down here. How cute is that, right? Now we can put sale today only, haha, ha, whatever you want. But this just makes it fun. It gives you something fun to do in your business and it makes it really, really unique, right? That That's always the best thing is to have something unique. Um, let's go back over to Clipping Magic and I'm gonna show you one more thing. So let's say that you have a particular graphic that you kind of want to play with. And <laughs> let's see. Let's try. That's something complicated. Who that's complicated. So let's say we wanted this. And this, and this. Now this is a tad bit complicated. Not something I would suggest for a first photo to play with. But if you did need something like this, um, it just gives, an, it gives you an idea of really how far you can take things and how cool it can be to actually play with all this stuff. So we're going to delete pretty much all of this and my internet is never going to catch up. I guess it's Sunday, so it thinks it's taking a day off too. Let's keep this. Okay. So you see how I can keep most of that background. Now we want to touch up so we can see over here. We want to get rid of that and that and that and kind of the spacey stuff in between, right? We don't want the green. Um, so there's a lot of cleanup there on this bag. Um, and then we're going to have to go down to five points to kind of look at this. We don't want the middle of that. So I'm gonna take that out. We don't want the middle of that. We don't want that. We don't want this. All right. So you can see how you can clean this up and then you can download. Now this is gonna be a bad graphic, but I'm gonna show you what you can do with it. So you're gonna download that. We'll save that as one so we can find it quickly. Go over to Canva and go home. And now let's click a Facebook post and upload, upload, desktop. And one. And now you can see, oh, we want to get rid of that text. All right, so now you can see you can play with a new graphic. And then you can put your own stuff in here. Now you'll have to fix that and and some of the details or take that out completely. But it just goes to show you how you can actually make something really cute and really unique to your own business by using that clipping magic and taking out um, background objects and things like that um, off of your graphics. Fun, fun, fun.